Church, I'm Vanessa, and this is John, and, and welcome, welcome to, to GT, GT Connect. Connect. In one week from today, we're having our church baptism at Passagrill Beach. It's going to be at 7 o'clock. If you have not followed the Lord in baptism, then this would be a great time to do it. We're going to sing, have testimony, and then we're going to go to the Gulf of Mexico so that people can get baptized. If you're interested, please call the church office. And on that same day, the youth are going to stick around after church, have some pizza, and then we're going to go hang out at the beach before that. So if you're a youth, we'll be hanging out at the beach all day. Rest of the church, join us at 7 for a baptism. We are going Disney for Wilderness Camping again this year on October 8th through the 11th. Space is very limited, so let us know you're going and get that deposited. This Thursday at 7, we're having a prayer meeting at church. It's July 23rd. Join Wade and Christine Schaefer for a time of worship, meditation, and prayer. We're going to meet in the choir room and everybody is invited. And don't forget, here on Tuesday mornings at 8.30, our prayer meetings, and then every day daily on Facebook Live at 12.30. Our online ministries are growing. Join us on Facebook daily at 12.30 for prayer. And then on Thursdays at 10.30 a.m., we're doing prime time with Susan and Ken Pippen. We have children's story time with Pastor Maddie Saturdays at 10. And of course, our regular church service at 10.45 a.m. on Sundays. Also, thank you to everybody who's been checking in on Facebook and helping us grow that presence. Well, that's all we got. Thanks for watching GT, GT Connect. And, and we'll, we'll see you next, next week. Why'd you jump in? Why'd you jump in? Oh, I forgot how to do the air exit. Yeah, but you should just let him have it and then say, thank you. I think it works. It, it's funny. No. It's funny. No. I think it's again. funny. No. I blame. Well, that's all we got. Thank you for joining GT Connect, and, and we'll, we'll see you next week. week. Hi, I'm Darla, and I'm here today to share with you about faith and about healing. I have been miraculously healed at least twice in my life. When I was 20 years old, I was diagnosed with ulcerative colitis and told that within seven years, I had a 50-50 chance of having cancer or being, or being well. God chose to heal me from that, and within the seven years, I was healed, and I no longer suffer from that condition, and I am thankful for that. When I was 51, I was diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia, which meant basically the front of my brain was going to just disintegrate, and I was given Actually, I was not given no chances. I was told that I would be dead within five to seven years. Well, this August, it's not, it'll be nine years, okay? God healed me, and I praise Him for it. I thank Him for it. And I know many of you need healing, but you must exercise faith. Faith is what will do it, along with prayer. So, God truly can heal you even when you have little to no chance. He will do it.